how's it guys today's video is going to be about the change in a state of bar we will first go over the theory part to learn what that is then hop into the market to look at a few examples and at the end i will combine it with other ict concepts to break them into models but before we go into the video itself please hit that subscribe button like and share this video with your friends and family let's go to the video so the first thing that we have to talk about is what is a change in a state of delivery a change in a state of delivery is when price goes from bullish to bearish or when price goes from bearish to bullish so we have price changing direction from going up to going down or from going down to going up that is our change in the state of delivery with our theory example here we have price moving higher up into a higher time frame pd array or level so we have price going up into this higher time frame pd array which can be an order block or a favorite gap on a higher time frame or simply a high on a higher time frame PD array. then we have the market closing below then we have the market closing below this low validating this up candles or this up candle as our order block so as soon as the market closes below this low this confirms to us that a change in a state of delivery is occurring then we, you can expect the market to retrace and tap into this you can expect the market to retrace into a premium into a premium market before we sell similarly with our bearish example we have the market moving down into a higher time frame pd array which can be a higher time frame order block or higher time frame pd array then we have the market closing above this high here validating this as our bullish order block when the, when the market closes above here it confirms that we are experiencing a change in a state of delivery in that now price is no longer going to offer lower lows and lower highs it's going to offer higher lows and higher highs so we can expect the market to retrace before into a discount before going further up so in in order to to recap okay guys so let's recap with this example we have price moving into a higher time frame pd array then as soon as the price hit the high time frame pd array price closes below this low here then it validates the up candles that are found in this leg from this low to this high as our order block then when this closure occurred here then we're, we're experiencing a change in the state of delivery then we expect the market to retrace into a, into into a premium market before selling and are taking this sell side liquidity similarly with our bearish example the market is moving down into a higher time frame pd array which can be your or a block or favorable gap or simply a low on a higher time frame pd array then we have the market closing above this high here validating this down candles here as your bullish order block then we can expect the market to retrace into a discounted market before we take on our buys so in essence that is our change in a state of delivery now let's go to the market to look at a few examples okay guys the first example that we're going to look at is on the us 80 on the one minute time frame so this will act as our higher time frame pd array because this is a high on our on our 15 minutes time frame so this is our liquidity on a 15 minutes time frame so we have the market trading above this high on a 15 minutes time frame but then we expect the market to close below this low which did not happen instead the market made this lower high lower higher low i mean so higher low then again it proceeded to break structure to the upside again breaking this high then we expect the market to come below this this up candles here so this one is no longer valid now we expect the market to come be below this candles here so as soon as the market closes here then this is validated as our order block this becomes our order block because our order block is a, is a, is a structure or is a pd area that is responsible for our change in a state of delivery so when this market closes here then we know that we're experiencing a change in a state of delivery then we expect the market to come we expect the market to come and retest an, an ict pd array in a premium market before we sell so what what other pdrs can we see if you look at this you look at you realize that we have this fairly gap here fairly gap is a fairly gap because the, the low of the first candle does not overlap with the high of the third candle so the space in between them makes a fairly gap so now we're expecting the market to go from a discounted price from a, a discounted price to a premium price where we can sell the market to target lows down so now let's look for, your, for our discounted price so our discounted price will be something like this so this we're going to look at this level gap in our discounted in the premium price before we sell so our entry is going to be something like this so the 50 percent here and your hydro stop loss just above this high and your target lows down here so this can be your first target this relative equal lows here this can be your target and you can target further lows from below so this is relative equal highs so lows i mean so this is perfect for your first target 
the entry is going to be something like that so for those who will be asking why didn't you sell here the reason we didn't sell here is because the market was not yet in a premium market so if you look at here if you put this flip here then this is our equilibrium let me do this this is our equilibrium so we have to wait for the market to go into a premium so here the market never went into a premium and instead it made this low so we're going to use this leg from this high to this low to look for our premium market so our premium market will be something like this anything above this line is premium anything below this line is a discount so we wait to sell here and we target the lows your entry and your position is going to be something like that like this as you can see it was hit why what was it hit because we have relative equal highs here something like this so the market wanted to attack this sell side liquidity here so from here to here you sell here you buy bigger position here now let's go and look at our second example for our second example we're on nasdaq 100 e mini futures on the one minute frame field so if you can see we have a low here which was traded through by this candle so this candle traded through this low so whenever so now we have to wait for the market to come and close above this candles here so the market close above these candles here then this confirms that we're we're experiencing a change in a state of delivery and a change in a state of delivery validate these down candles as our order block so what do we do we wait for the market to come and retrace into a discounted price here before we can sell so now let's look at for our discounted price so before we can buy so this is something like this so we have this fair value gap here we have this fair value gap here where we can buy which is in a this is equilibrium then this fair value gap the 50 percent of this fair value gap fell into a discounted market which is perfect for us to buy so your position is going to be something like this then you're gonna you're going to target let's say you target this high seat this high seat you got it comes to your target or this volume imbalance here let's target this volume imbalance and you hide your stop loss just below this low so this is how your entry is going to look so your entry is going to look something like this so these down candles are your order block and these candles here becomes your fair value gap so you combine your order block with the fair value gap to create an entry so even if you look at the fair, at the order block here let's look at the 50 percent of the order block realize that the 50 percent of the order block came in and retested here so even in here you can come and buy here and target this old high again so if you have enjoyed this video please consider subscribing liking and commenting down on this video and give me a suggestion about future videos fully made again peace out